Hello, uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I am going to do a more of an updated night routine um, because tonight is the first night where I actually feel like I haven't had anything on essentially and I've had a whole day of chilling and it's to be fair it's actually quite nice to be back in Cheltenham um, but currently as you would have seen I'm just finishing going on the train. I haven't got much left. I've read about 100 pages today. Um, and yeah, I'm going to do some editing. Though to be fair, a difference is we have a little poochie. A little poochie. It's very cute. But that focus square is totally not attractive. Anyway. Um, I filmed my workout today, um, I was going to, I was going to do a weekly vlog, um, however I just really have not filmed much this week so what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert it here, um, thanks, um, I did it as a YouTube short but I'll insert it here. <laughs> Okay, so we're starting off with some dynamic stretches. So these are around the world. I'm pretty sure that's what they're called. Um, so basically you can get a bar or like a um, resistance band and just, just go around. And it sort of warms up your back muscles and your shoulder muscles. Um, because this was a shoulder day, I wanted to do some of these where I was just warming up like the shoulder muscles because I felt really sore this day, um, yeah I was doing quite a lot of heavy lifting uh, the past couple of days so just felt like I needed an extra, extra little bit of a warm up. Then we moved into chest press. So I did, I think it was 10 reps for 4 sets, um, but I started off light and I went heavy so each set I increased my weight, so pretty sure I ended up doubling my weight at the end of this. I moved into a narrow grip chest press. Um, I kept this one pretty light I think um, just because I find this one a lot harder than the actual chest press. I think it's just getting a really small muscle which I don't train very often um, but yeah I really love this exercise actually. And just to add this was 10 reps for four sets as well. Um, and then we went into a superset, so I did lateral raises, pretty sure this was 5 to 10 on each arm. Um, I really love these, these like really got my shoulders this particular day. Um, and then once we get to it, I then superset it with around the worlds. Um, and with this, especially these two exercises actually, I kept them pretty light because accuracy is really key because obviously it's getting a really small muscle group and you don't want to overdo it because obviously if you overdo it that's when injury um, comes around. So yeah, I just kept with what, whatever way I felt comfortable. Oh, hello, hello, you're joining me in the kitchen. We are chefing it up in the kitchen. Yay. Um, tonight, God, it sounds like I'm cooking a gourmet meal. Um, tonight, I am doing, this sounds so bougie, I'm doing um, an egg fried rice concoction. Um, but yeah, essentially, I've got like a salmon fillet thingy, rice cake, whatever the hell they're called. 
have some mushrooms. That sounds really wrong. Having some mushrooms. I'm gonna cut up some carrots. That's my dog. Um, I'm trying not to drop this chicken stock on the floor. This, I've literally just tried it. You can't even see it. Honestly, the best egg fried rice I think I've made for myself. Hands down. Nothing beats my dad's. My dad is some elite level of like egg fried rice. Like, I don't think you could ever beat my dad's egg fried, egg fried rice. It's just because he loves it so much that he like obviously cooks it so much. That is some good egg fried rice. Not gonna lie. I've eaten dinner and I'm watching Afterlife and it's actually really sad. That's what I'm doing. I'm so tired. It's literally 10 to 8 and I feel like I could go to sleep. Oh, you know you're getting old when you really struggle to stay awake at this time of night. When I tell you, I... I'm so sore from the gym. It's not an exaggeration. Hold on, let me get this tripod to stand up. I can't even see me, Omar. I can't even tell you. The pain is unreal. And I haven't felt this sore from the gym in a very, very long time, as I was saying. Um, yeah, the pain is just unreal. I really just don't stand. I'm honest with you. Um, I honestly, I don't understand, but it must be the fact that I'm walking to the gym in chapel. Because, like, I do the same here as I would do when I'm at home. And that the only difference between here and at home is I walk to gym. So walking essentially kills you. The only time today where I've actually felt alright position where my body is in a straight line. Lying down, trying to get up, everything. My battery's gonna die. But in other news, that's literally all for today's video. I don't think this is gonna last for the outro. Um, but we can try it. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed tagging along my evening. Um, as I said, I would have put um, my um, my push day workout um, towards the beginning of the video just because I wanted to make it a little bit more like meaty than just, you know, all that fun stuff. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and yeah, I'll see you soon for another one. Bye. And look, he's staring at himself. How cute. Oh, this dog is just the cutest thing. <laughs>